these guys are training partners. These guys are, you know, best friends. Yeah. These guys are teammates. And these guys, this isn't the first time we've seen them interact in a tournament, right? They've had to face off against each other, not just in a top eight environment, but in a top three scenario, mm -hmm. especially in 2020. I believe Angry Bird was the one that gate kept Big Bird into qualifying two times over. Uh, Big Bird just fell short with second and also third as well in one of those events in 2020. So this is going to be oh tough. Let's see goodness. if Big Bird can rewrite oh. history. Oh, boy. Old school Big Bird bringing out the Ken Masters. Newly improved Ken Masters. Oh, my goodness. This is what I like to see. I'm not mistaken, right? This is a throwback character. Big Bird used to play this character a lot, 100%, right? Yeah, okay, 100%. Okay, okay. Big Bird started off with Ken. Okay. I want to make sure I wasn't mistaken there. Angry Bird, of course, established with that Seth. Let's see who takes it. Ooh, already testing him on the come down. You can see getting out of that V skill range, but getting into that range of that back medium punch. Wake up, back medium punch. Man. Oh, yeah. yeah. Counter conversion. Yeah. That is clean. That's what I like to see. Put them on the verge of stun, and Angry Bird not showing any fear. Just waking up with buttons. Meaty me, then, if you really want that stun. Oh, oh axe kick. We stay in in front. Front throw as well, trying to whittle down this life lead. Not checking the dash here. V trigger not available for Big Bird either. Use that V reversal. Ooh, stay checking medium punch. That medium punch on both sides. I like that. Checking Angry Bird. See, that was like a hybrid between a buffer and a, and a confirm, to yeah. be quite honest with you. I couldn't tell because Angry Bird was just a shot away from that normal connecting. I couldn't tell. And now Angry Bird going to utilize this to get that corner carry. Keeping it nice and tight with the frame traps here, but Big Bird is not biting. Ooh. Yep, just outside that range. Not expecting it to whiff, though. Ooh, trying to fetch out a button. Yes, sir. Low forward finds the mark instead with the delay. Angry Bird now. V-shift after a block V-skill. I don't blame you. Yeah, all right. Trying to get that dodge. Oh, you tried to press buttons on that. You were just outside of range. Back medium punch and tried with the hezzy on the crouch medium punch, but not giving it to him. Ooh, dashing in after that crouch medium kick. I oh. love it. Oh. He tried to get a run to sneak it. Oh, oh no, no. He's dead. What happened? We saw a counter hit crouch jab from the side of Angry Bird, but... Yeah, it was weird. They ended up <sighs> dropping that target combo, dropped right at the end there. And, of course, Big Bird going to be more <sighs> than happy to take advantage of that. Was it a spacing issue? Uh, I'm not sure. I think I... there was, like, a pushback on top of the crouching jab, allowing the... Or at least not allowing the rest of the hits to continue right he went for medium punch into the fierce the target yeah, combo yeah. right that's exactly what we see time and time again angry bird is he's he's hit that before i wonder if it was a spacing thing I really yeah, do. It, it probably was to be honest with you i mean it was counter hit jab right so there's a little bit of pushback maybe just a little bit out of range yeah a pixel or two out of range no it was punished from the, the crouching heavy kick but still angry bird found the mark and another counter hit this time not missing at all uh four fierce two dashes up okie Oh, and just a back dash from Big Bird here. He's like, all right, I will take this corner as long as I get some space back. Ooh, the fireball is actually paying off here. Dangerous fireballs. What a confirm. Confirm City. Big Bird. Oh, did get another hit, but didn't confirm this time. Oh, micro step out of the way. Target combo for the punish. Plus frames here. Oh, another misconfirm. Yeah, no confirm on that cross medium kick. Unfortunate. On the way down. Damn. Ugh. Ooh, Did you see that? All he needed. There was a reversal on the side of Big, uh, from the side of Big Bird. Ooh. It might have been a Tatsu. Yeah, yeah, the three-frame Tatsu, perhaps. Yeah, try to wake up with his only three-frame option. Mm, put that away. What a whiff punish! Oh, that's a punish. That is a clean punish. Yeah, maybe that's why he goes with Ken in this matchup, right? Not gonna allow him to just do crouch medium kick oh. and a spin kick. Ooh, beats him to the punch on that crouch medium kick. Actually not in range, and he got the whiff punish off of it. And now continuing that game. Oh, continuing that game, this time with a throw bait. Angry Bird responding at Kine here, using a bar. What's the last setup going to be? Oh, no. He let him drop just to get the Oki instead of the damage. He might regret it. Oh, long. This is on the sweep, but he doesn't actually kill. Puts him on the pixel. Plus yeah, plus frames. frames. Just back dashes. Oh, so that was a blocked V skill, right? Angry mm -hmm. Bird was thinking, all right, well, Big Set Bird wins. might take his turn back, but instead, two steps ahead, Big Bird's like, no, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna walk back and try to steal my turn, but the low short was just enough to stop him in his tracks. 
Yeah, I think it was one of those scenarios where it's like, okay, you're negative after the V skill, so perhaps Big Bird was going to try to take advantage of that and walk forward and throw, right? And uh, Angry Possibly. Bird was like, nah, 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 fam. You don't get that close. <laughs> Crouch light kick. Good call there from Angry Bird. Oh, oh. yeah. Just getting the, the spin kicks right right within range. And you know that fireball is traveling mad slow. Yeah, for sure. He's got blocked from long distance. He's going to uh -oh. backdash after and punish this Tatsu. Yeah, he was just within range. He caught a buffered normal from the side of Big Bird, hence why you saw the Tatsu. Yep, continuing with the combo. Plus three. Oh, yes, that's going to be an activation here. Run combo. Oh, I love that. That's big Oki. There you see. Oh. EX off the low medium kick mm. once again, and then baits out the EX DP. Caught onto his habit perfectly. Angry Bird taking the lead. Good call out there from Angry Bird. Again, not wanting to press the issue or get the corner carry. He just waited for Big Bird to make the mistake instead, just leaving it mid-screen. No sense of urgency there from Big Bird, not even trying to spend the bar. No. Oh! Catches the stand heavy kick. We got him in the corner, just take the throw. We'll see how many more you can take. Ooh. Not willing to. Excellent call from Big Bird, letting the EX rock and it finds the mark. And it's a great time because again, oh my Rid God. Ridiculous whip punish right there. Puts him on the verge of stun. All he needs is that to take the round. Oh, the spin kick. No find the projectile, but an EXDP again. You can't train this man. Two for three. So far in the set. Ugh, back throw to seal the deal. All tied up here. One game apiece, one round apiece. Big Bird finding huge refuge in these EX uppercuts that have been saving these rounds for him. Mm-hmm. It's been such a close set. You can see how close these guys are in terms of skill. Obviously, great sparring partners, great friends, know each other inside and out. Ooh! Again, the whiff punish on the crouch medium kick with his own. A time to V-shift, not there. Angry Bird 100% ready for it, full on punish. Mad Cradle, you cannot neutral jump on this man. Sniff it out, don't pity this, this, this character. <laughs> oh, okay. Not gonna bite on that slight hesitation as he walks forward. Does get the crouch media punch all the way into the Hikatonkari's punch, into the super. That's gotta be more than enough, right? There was like, what, two, three hits behind it? He's dead. Ooh, indeed. No questions here. Angry Bird taking the lead two to one. Just one more game to seal the deal and repeat his re results from last year's Capcom Pro Tour. Can he find that repeat? against Ken, will Big Bird switch characters? That's That was going to be my thought, for sure. That's immediately where my brain went. Are we going to try to fight it out with this Ken? Obviously buffed in Season 5.5, but Big Bird has played oh. so much Rashid that he's going to leave him on the bench. Out. Oh. That's so sick. Oh, big jump in. Yeah, well within range. Target combo. Fierce uppercut to end it. Good amount of damage on the board. Crush counter sweep. How many dashes? Four? For real. Trying to drag him towards the corner, whether he likes it or not. Oh, that could have left some big damage if he left the jump and rock, right? Yeah, but either way, he'll take it. Gets the advantage here and stole what? something. That was tight. Had the DP. He stole as well to combo off of it. Oh, Normally, you can't you can't combo into a medium kick like that, but you have these skills stored. You get to let it rock. That was so brilliant from Angry Bird. Yeah, but he's got it again if he wants it. So, you know, that's in the back of Big Bird's mind. Throws the normal that he tried to put out. I hate it when that happens, man. Yeah, it feels real bad. <laughs> Oh, oh, what happened? Big Bird just went for the raw run. He even gave a little pep talk towards the end. <laughs> yeah. Let us step your game up. Because right now, Angry Bird looking to take that Capcom Cup spot. Just one match away. Excellent whiff punish from Big Bird to get started. Pushing Angry Bird into the corner now. You see Angry Bird fishing away. No miss input from the axe kick. Yeah, no punish from Big Bird. Unfortunate does finally get a V skill and a combo off of it. He's been fishing for a lot of the V-Skill at this range. See it once again. <laughs> fishing away yet again. Target combo plus frames. Just within range to get the punish on the crouch jab against Angry Bird. Yeah, the Big Bird showing a lot of respect. Angry Bird popping the V-Trigger. Ooh, we punished that time, but didn't have any V-Trigger to cancel Ooh, into on his no. own. No hmm. punish, right? Ooh, fireball catching a flinch and wanted to take to the skies after that crouch medium kick. No, sir. 
trying to think about what was going on through Big Bird's mind listening to that whiff Oh, we'll talk about that later. We got a crush counter anyway. Roundhouse Tatsu for the carry. Yeah, man, has him locked in this corner. Ooh, Ooh Another stop. crush. Yep, on the verge of stun here. He knew a back throw would have killed or a jump fierce. I think he's got enough damage here. Seth bleeds tremendously. Oh, tries for a reset, actually. Oh, he might regret this in a couple of more, a couple of sequences. Side switch. No EX dashes up for Oki instead. And Big Bird finds redemption. EX uppercut again and again, not deterred. And what a time to use it, honestly. I feel like he would have died if it was blocked. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and that's probably why he did it, right? He was like, okay, Angry Bird's got to be considering the fact that if I DP here and I block it, my Capcom Cup life is over. Yeah. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do it. You can't train me. I will be stubborn. I will make these unexpected decisions. Big Bird tying the setup one match away from resetting. Feeling real strong coming straight out of chest day. Yeah. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> Gym Rat's hit different. He's just like, I'm ready for this. He's making, he's utilizing these EXDPs with his whole chest. That's for sure. Mm -hmm. We'll see. Ooh, slowly oh. walk to the corner. And now, ooh, nice punish. Excellent tech from Angry Bird. Oh, even better whiff punish from Big Bird. I love it. Crouch Fierce into the EX Tatsu. Oh, that was a sick punish. I like that. Full target combo, full exposure. He's not going to spend the V-Trigger yet. There it is, yeah. After the Mad Cradle. Yeah, that was beautiful. Oh, no. Got caught reaching here. Angry Bird gets the stun on him. Going to put him back into the corner as well. Oh, oh. Oh, on the way down. <laughs> on the way down. Maximum efficiency. Angry bird. We were just watching to see if it really was the amount of damage it needed to be. And of course, don't ever doubt that Seth V Trigger one. Mm -hmm. On tournament point yet again, punishing the V skill. Excellent time to neutral jump. Big bird now enforcing the law. Oh, and that was actually a reset. Didn't combo into that run, or excuse me, that dash jab, but you know, he'll take that. Oh my god, I think he's a back throw away and Big yeah. Bird or Angry Bird knew it as well. Yeah. Oh no EXDP this time is actually a tech throw. You should see Big Bird. Oh wow, just recovered in time to not get clipped by that V skill. Oh, that could have been interruptible. Excellent time to V reversal. That was a heavier spin kick. Again, yeah, it's plus frames there. Oh, cross cut DP at the corner? Mm -hmm. That is so hard to do, just being able to space it out that way. And Big Bird just clutching it out. EX uppercut saves him again. Yeah, exactly right. And utilizing the EX. Because I'm not even going to risk the anti-air DP. I want the full invul EX DP. Yeah, fishing. Oh, oh my goodness. So many with crouch medium kicks, but Big Bird can't find the whiff punish. And you saw him attempt to, right, with the sand medium punch. Oh, I like that punish. Yeah. You would improve buff. Oh, and then breaks the glass here. This is all falling apart for Angry Bird. So close to a reset. Can Big Bird accomplish it? Tries to duff him one more time. Double dash. dash get off me. Big Bird, 3-2. We are going to a 0-0 reset for that Capcom Cup spot. That was nasty. That was actually kind of nasty. Did you see the confidence in that man? He was like, stand short. Ugh, get off me. <laughs> yeah. That was so sick. And that's something that I think Big Bird is always on point with, but especially with this Ken in this set, is these micro walks out of these tick throw setups, and he commits the button immediately, right? He doesn't give that window of opportunity. We always joke about how with throws in this game are plus two. Not against Big Bird, right? He is ready and committing to those buttons as soon as he steps out of the range of the throw. I really love his gameplay. So now, uh, you know, since it is a reset, Big Bird is at liberty to change characters, by the way. True. Yeah, he can he can change characters here at the start. I mean, I don't think either of us think he's going to. No. Considering he just won the set with Ken. <laughs> but he is free to do so, of course, because it is 0-0. Zero, zero. We're all reset at the bracket. Angry Bird finally bleeding heavily here. Does take down a set from Big Bird. I'm kind of curious as to how different it would be if Angry Bird were to change it up with Zeku. But keep in mind, you saw what transpired in the early part of that set. I mean, Angry Bird was taking the lead a good amount of the times. And uh, Big Bird found a lot of success in taking such huge risks behind EXDP. So I don't think there's going to be a switch up solicited from Angry Bird. And as you see there, he sticks with Seth. Yeah, V skill one, V trigger one. Everything still kosher. One and one. Into the dojo. I like that. They're going to need to fill it up with some of these uh, inside world open objects. Yeah, I need the gold. Please, everywhere. But right now, 
who's going to get the gold for this tournament, who will get that first place spot and get in the Capcom Cup. Oh. Big whip punish leads to the stun, and that's great. Only two hits behind it. Yeah, big momentum for Angry Bird here. We'll throw away. Ooh. Doesn't commit to anything beyond that oh. crouch light kick and a great whiff punish on the stand roundhouse with the crouch roundhouse. My man was inspecting the tatami mat. He was like, hey, <laughs> is, this, is this solid foundation? Is this, a, is this like, you know, a good dojo to conduct our practices in? My man was looking for the secret compartments, the investigation <laughs> checks. He's like, where's the hole in the floor? Oh, man, way to stuff out the startup of that fireball. And what a great way to get that corner transition. And now Angry Bird locking up the bird. The other bird, I should say. Mm -hmm. We got cage birds either way here in the corner. Oh, baits out the EXDP finally, right? We've seen Big Bird rely on that time and time again to get him out of these scenarios where he has to guess. Is he going to do it again, though? Yes. No, he's oh, not. He missed the combo with all the difficult yeah. stuff. Unfortunately for him, dropping at the last instance. Oh, my goodness. But wow, we're just pressing buttons. We know when moves are going to whiff, even when they hit. Oh, and no. he gets to the other side, just gets He's the run. dead. He is indeed. EXDP does enough damage, and Big Bird snatches victory from the jaws of defeat. Can we talk about that missed second half of the axe kick and Big Bird knowing full well what to do with it? Dude, that was ridiculous, man. That was actually so good. You could tell how much these fellas have played. Beautiful. Yeah, that's plus. Good respect on the plus frame spin kick. Oh. Big whiff punish from the roundhouse. Catching the poke from Big uh, Angry Bird. Oh, dashed Ugh. into it. Installed. And we'll see. Yeah, you can see Angry Bird being careful, not try to commit to that spin kick off the crotch medium kick anymore because it can be punished by that fierce DP. I would love to use Seth to use Ken's own buff against him in the fireball. What a whip punish! It was so sick, man. The fact that it leaves him grounded after the Tatsu as well for the full extension. That is so nasty. The red on the screen! Angry Bird is getting smooth. He committed oh. because he saw the hit, but it was an air hit. Oh. You kidding me? You still get to Mad Cradle after that? Oh, yeah, fam. Has to be trigger available. Doesn't commit that time, though. Oh, V trigger activation. Tries to walk back and get a throw bait, not Lost giving frames. it to him. Respects it all and respects it a little bit too much. Ooh. Angry Bird takes that opportunity to toss him to the other side of the screen. Man, set. there were so many crazy instances in that set alone. In that game alone, man. Big Bird really pulling out all the surprises here. And, of course, Angry Bird maintaining his composure. I was trying to think, again, one of my one of the, the things that was going on through my mind, I was like, can Seth V-Skill pass the fireball? <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, that's a good point. That's all I wanted to see. That's all I was trying to say. Honestly. With, a, with a, the stored V-Skill, right? The yeah. DP, yeah. It would have been so funny to just see the first hit connect and then Ken still be grounded for the rest of it. Yeah. That, that would have been funny. Like, now you know how I feel. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Dodging the uh, target combo, medium kick, heavy kick. Oh, yeah. You find a confirm. Actually, a big punish against the whiff throw. Oh! Oh! oh speaking of big punish, new... Gets the jump in combo. Ah, mm -hmm. oh, yes. The classic punish there from the Big Bird. Knowing full well how negative it is. Nice V shift. Oh, no. Oh. It's not going to get him out of trouble. Wow. Oh, the hard stuff. Wow. The hard stuff. Oh, my goodness. I haven't seen that combo since the Seth trailer. <laughs> the facts, right? Exactly. Ridiculous stuff from Angry Bird. Pulling it out in a match. I mean, you heard Man Shore, man. He called him the best set. Oh. Actually, I think Sakonoma was the one that came up with that. My mistake. It probably was, right? I mean, maybe they got him for the trailer. Either way. Ooh. Gonna catch him reaching. The and then delay. the counter hit. Let's go. Oh, we with the low. Oh, I like that. Angry Bird gets baited out by Big Bird in the jump. EX Tatsu thinking he can mad cradle the anti-air. Not this time. Yeah, but Big Bird has V-Trigger. Gotta be looking out for that stand heavy kick, and that's exactly what he wanted. Great with punish and Ooh, side switch. What? Big Bird with the cross under to get the side switch with the bad cradle. That was ridiculous. Get so the hard to time. EX Tatsu off the target combo. Now we got the corner game. Tries to catch the throw bait. Not gonna give it to him. Axe kick stays in front. EX oh. Fireball does clip him though. Clutch so throw close. tech. The X Fireball chipping oh, away. Oh, oh, oh. And the throw bait again from Big Bird. Ridiculous, man. I can't believe how close every match has been. He walked up ever so slightly, and Angry Bird knew it, too. With the amount of life he had left, he couldn't afford to throw. He had to commit to that option. 
Oh, oh at the last God. second. Yeah. No, you got that? Mm -hmm. Oh, using the DP as well. He had it stored. Bit of extra damage. Oh, no, again. again. A slight mishap from the side of Angry Bird, and Big Bird makes sure that he pays for it. Gets that roundhouse. Oh! Big Bird has his V-Trigger available now, but runs into the jab. Oh, no! Run combo puts him all the way to the corner. What are we doing with here? Tries for the cross-up. Great block. And now Angry Bird going to activate off the target combo. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. not going to finish it because, again, there's too much scaling involved. No point in doing so as you lose the side! Oh! Give me that! You tried to fireball me while I'm V-skilling you? Not today. What is that, 2-0? It is. It is 2-0 in the reset now for Angry Bird. Oh, my God. It's so close, though. I can't believe it's 2-0. But, man, every round feels like it's gone down to pixel versus pixel. I'll cheers to that. Yeah. <laughs> two, two, two Red Bull athletes going in and out of uh, what seems to be near death every single time. Holy smokes. Now, Angry Bird one match away from solidifying his position in Capcom Cup. Big Bird, of course, you see, is sticking with the can, his back against the wall. There's no other character he can bring this W home with at this point. Oh, giant jump in uh, on the punish from Big Bird, just at the right range to anticipate that V-Skill. Nice. Able to interrupt the fireball, and of course, Angry Bird making the most out of the interrupt. Back dash, oh. let him take that, but the ass kick whiff. Oh, no. So the amount of damage here, Big Bird enforcing the law with that throw. Again, Angry Bird with a clutch attack. Oh! That was beautiful. Just backdash out of the punches. Gets the clean whiff punish afterwards. Oh, woke up with a stand roundhouse. Ooh. Checking the low-medium kick. A nice and easy stand. Short. Big Bird taking very little risks behind that. Falling. Or actually, Angry Bird just falling just short in this game. Oh, yeah, that's plus frames. Yeah, catches him with the crouch light kick and then the medium kick. Oh, yes! Time didn't find the mark this time. Great adjustment from Angry Bird here, but now he's got to deal with Ken in the corner. Ooh. Yeah, plus frames again. Ooh, a little bit of a scramble there. Angry Bird getting yeah. the most of it with the low medium kick confirmed. Oh. Runs into the v -seal. That is the counter hit. Push up to the corner. Dash up to... Oh, actually, just walk up to him menacingly. Yeah, the stand heavy hit got eaten up by that V-Skill. Nice punish. Ooh, just the bag the impit jet confirmed it as well with no counter hit. Ooh. That's a forward throw again, trying to put, he puts himself in the corner. No, just runs into the throw, not dead yet, but you're definitely dead after this. Full on chip damage. And I love that Angry Bird obviously being well aware that he is within range to die to a single combo, so he is gonna spin the meter. And now we're looking at tournament point for Angry Bird. Big Bird with a good amount of resources left to inflict huge damage. If he gets to confirm, right, Angry Bird is well aware of that, not pressing too much here in neutral. Yeah, exactly. Big Bird already down as well. There we go. Get that little fireball game going. Try to find his way to dash in. Let me see Angry Bird has done such a good job checking. Oh, but my oh, God. Just as I say that, just as I think that, catches the throw bait. Catching Angry Bird off guard like that to just dash up and then walk out of the space. Oh, boy. Big confirm now into the corner. Big push. Back throw instead. Wake up for Big Bird. An excellent tag, but just within range for the round. to hit. This is my corner. Oh, and he got caught reaching again directly into the critical heart. Send a message. Get a little breather for yourself as you put a W on the board. Big Bird does a fantastic job of, of inflicting that fear of whether or not to throw whether or not to block this normal and just dashing in your face to get these reactions from Angry Bird. He's done that time and time again just because of the threat of how much meter he had, right? Off just that alone, that fact alone, it really deterred Angry Bird from trying to press buttons in neutral. Yeah, 100%. And, you know, that's a great uh, hallmark of a great player is taking advantage of your opponent's expectations, and that's exactly what Big Bird did. Oh, again, catching him with a V skill, though, just in the neutral. Wow! Wake up with an invul throw DP. Ooh, and then catching the heavy oh. spin kick with the toxic, or excuse me, the target combo. Oh, that's really unfo- Wait, not that bad. Okay. Not that bad after all. Angry Bird does get a side switch and a punish, but still. Oh, Ooh. this is dangerous. Angry Bird is in dire straits here. A pivotal tech. He had to do it. 
Respecting the kicks and punishing in kind. Big Bird. One round away from tying the set up. And he set the bar for that. He wanted to make a statement. He's like, I'm not saving this for the next round. I'm going to make sure you feel it. Mm hmm. Oh, again with the interruption on the target combo. That's so good. And the delayed Ooh. crouch medium punch to blow up the tech from Angry Bird into a full counter hit combo. Not quite finishing the job. The stun is going away. Yeah, he's going to be able to dodge the stun here. Oh, my goodness. And then checks the run. Here we go, Angry Bird. The door's open for the comeback. Quickly shut by the EXDP. Oh, and then catches the ankles. Big Bird, what was just a 2-0 set, ties it up immediately, and we're going to a final game for the Middle East Capcom Cup spot. They know what they're doing, Ringe. <laughs> they know what they're That's doing. What I'm talking about. They want to make sure they drag it out to the very end. And honestly, what more could we ask for? This is great. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's what I want to see. Woo. Oh, my goodness. And he's bringing it back with Ken, too. He was down 2-0. Oh no choice left. We're all locked into the characters. Mm -hmm. Who's taking home this Capcom Cup spot? It's so funny to see because Angry Bird, again, a big Zeku main going with his alternate. And then you see Big Bird from his main to his original character. Beautiful stuff. I really like it. The Ken versus the Seth. Oh. He committed Ooh. to the V skill. Huh. You do get a full on punish. And now Angry Bird getting locked up into this corner. Big Bird doing a fantastic job of nailing all these. No. <gasps> Yeah, that's that heavy kick does clip, but he wasn't really ready for it. Hit really late. Nice whip punish with that. Ooh. The neutral jump in anticipation for the trigger activation. No sweep for you. Big Bird is two steps ahead and now one round away. I cannot believe this. Big Bird, who's down 2-0 in the reset now, up for the first time. Oh, big punish. whip punish. Angry Bird now pushing, yeah, V reverse or V shift out of there, gets covered. Oh, Not again. again! The Mad Cradle whiffing, opening the door for the crush counter. Now we have the corner. Oh, again, dumps him. Committing to the EX Fireball, though, doesn't get too much damage. He tried to dash up to kind of enforce any sort of, I don't know, maybe like a throw in normal, but Angry Bird was 100% ready for it. Oh, yeah, respecting the V skill this time, oh, trying to catch him walking boy. back. Oh, boy. Oh, blowing oh. through the Fireball. Okay, trigger is on deck for Angry Bird. Oh, oh my that's God. what I was talking about. Do not neutral jump the fireball. He likes Tatsu. Now we got the activation. If he lands one hit, it's over. It's absolutely over. If Angry Bird can find the hit with critical arc. Oh, no. Big Bird committing to the DP off the crouch medium kick. Who Ooh. takes a quick bow as we get our final, final round? Stole it from Dimitri. Oh, yo, he's fishing. He's trying to get oh, the hook. Oh, again, no. we talked about that, right? The whiff throws on Big Bird, always ready to punish them. Ooh. Oh, yes. Excellent punish on the spin kicks. Angry Bird forced himself to use that V shift out of pressure. Ugh. Yeah, and he just went right back to the well as well with the stand heavy kick, close enough to get thrown back. Man, oh. a slight little greeting from both. Whiff throws. Angry Bird doesn't get the forward throw now. Enforcing oh. the point now. And that's going to be it. Angry Bird gets the stun and solidifies his spot in Capcom Cup. Well done. I mean, he was on the verge of losing. He went into Grand Finals winner's side, went up 2-0 in the reset after getting reset by Big Bird, and then got it all the way brought back. Actually was losing for the first time in the set in the final game, was down around, and then brought it back two straight. I mean... He's a world-class caliber player, can win a tournament anywhere in the world, online, offline, and he's going to get a chance to prove that once again at Capcom Cup 2021. Do believe we have Angry Bird on the line for his winner interview. Big ups to Angry Bird, making it again into Capcom Cup. My man. Thank you, thank you, guys. Nice. That's all I can say right now, man. Well, well, you still remember that. Of course I do, man. I never let it go. I never let it go. Listen, all jokes aside, though, big congratulations to you, Angry Angry Bird. Man, so going into it, you had a trail of bodies left behind you, but the only person to make you really bleed or at least show signs oh of like, you God. know, <laughs> yeah, signs of stress was GTR. Tell me what was going on through your mind when that match was happening against GTR. Oh, against GTR, actually, like maybe you guys don't know, but us and GTR, like, uh, we practice a lot together, mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. we know each other's habits. So I know, like, uh, I lost the first game, but like when I lose the first game, I still think there is a lot of room of improvement in my gameplay, so I don't get nervous and continue playing. 
Shoutouts to him though. He played sick this uh, tournament. Oh yeah. Throughout uh, the whole tournament, actually, he played sick. He beat Big Bird, sent him to losers, and then almost beat me. So like he did very good, and congratulations to him. Yeah, big ups. I thought GTR was definitely one of the MP MVPs of our top eight. But of course, it sounded like you were a bit stressed about that grand finals, right? That's kind of where you went with the oh my oh god. My god. Yeah, so, oh my so, god. So, so tell me about that, right? I mean, coming down to the wire, of course, Big Bird resetting. Then you going up 2 0, only for him to bring it back and actually put you on round away from losing the tournament. Walk me through that. Oh my god. Like, you know what? I know he was going to big Ken because, like, like whenever Ken got buffed, he used to smoke me. Like he, <laughs> the first time we played, he, he smoked me so hard. I said, Sh I shouldn't blade him. Now he knows that Ken is the is the character to play against me in tournament. <laughs> <laughs> so, so what I was thinking is, like uh, today before the top eight, I knew I was going to face him at some point. So I was like uh, reviewing how I played against Ken and everything and practiced a lot against Ken. But Ooh. oh my god, like this set was like one of the best we've played actually. And like actually all of our sets are usually like this. Like he beats me, I beat him and then like that. So congratulations to him as well and uh yeah, GG's. Yeah, I, I was telling uh, Vicious, my co-commentator, we could write a dissertation. We can give a full lecture on your guys' matches. You could just see the familiarity and, like, the high-level decision-making going behind every single piece of neutral between you two. It's really dope to see two players that high-level really familiar mm -hmm. with each other. So big ups to you as well. I know you're congratulating everybody else, but you are the thank champion you, today. Thank you so much. Do you, do you get the, the relief <laughs> a little bit? You get to relax. You are in Capcom Cup. How does that feel? Yeah, it actually feels super great. Since I qualified last year and it didn't happen, Kamen Cup didn't happen. Mm -hmm. So last year I was actually like going super hard, try mm -hmm. hard mood on Capcom Cup. I was preparing mm -hmm. for everyone. But like it's a shame it didn't happen. But here, here it is again. I qualified. So I'll have to go hard mood again on myself. That's it. And we're starting to see, again, like the Middle East region uh, being shown the spotlight even more. And I got to say, you and Big Bird have been pretty much the pillars of your community, but we're starting to see a lot of people show exponential growth in the region, right? We're seeing some of these cats show uh, even better results than they did last year and the year before. Can you talk to us a little bit about the community and like the, the I guess, upcoming stars that we've seen from our top 16 going into this top eight? Can you kind of like highlight sure, sure. some of those players in there as well? Yeah, actually, like throughout the top 16, I'm so happy to see a lot of Middle Eastern players representing the top 16 like Mature, uh, GTR, Dark Fellow, these guys are like, they play on a daily basis. And I'm happy to see all of us, like uh, the hard work pays off at the end. Like this time we had top three, uh, actually, yeah, top three in the, from the UAE, mm -hmm. which mm -hmm. is so good. Uh, like I said, like uh, GTR, like during the COVID thing, because there is no travels to tournaments and stuff, all this time we've been practicing against him. I can see how he improved, mm -hmm. like, so much he improved. So, shout-outs to him for sure. And the other guys uh, and, the, and the rest of the top eight, even the Turkish guys the, and the other guys. Shout-outs to all of them. Uh, we had an amazing tournament. Absolutely. That was a phenomenal top eight. Thank you for being a part of it. Thank you for growing Thank the middle so East scene as well, man. And like, as you, like, as Vicious said, you two are the pillars, and you could see the fellas that are yeah, playing with you. Best. Yeah, that was great stuff. Thank you again. It really shows. And again, thank you so much. Thank you guys for commentating our matches. And uh, I hope to see you on offline basis. <laughs> oh, yeah without, a, yeah. without a doubt. We're Hell looking forward yeah. to it. Again, big congrats sure, sure. to you, Angry Bird. Any final thoughts to any of your competitors going forward for the Capcom Cup or just any sort of shout outs you want to give just in these final moments as we congratulate you? Uh, actually, I want to say shout outs to everyone who qualified so far. And uh, like, I wish my favorite players qualifies as well as me so i can meet all of them in capcom cup again and yeah. like play again yeah beautiful thank you again angry bird congratulations good looking out go enjoy your much deserved you relaxation so much, after the w thank you all once again for joining us here on twitch.tv nice, nice. <laughs> that's what i'm talking about it's my boy no, you know i don't want to shout because my brother is sleeping like, uh, oh, okay. so, yeah. I'll, do it. I'll do it for you don't worry about that angry bird. we appreciate you man enjoy the rest of your day thank you thank you guys take care